Hello everyone. We are looking forward to welcoming some of you back to school very soon for Term 6 and to see those that have already been coming to school in Term 5 again. We wanted to let you know about some things that are a little bit different. We know how good you are at listening to and following our rules, so it is important that you listen carefully as we explain some of the new rules we have for you coming back to school. When it is your time to arrive at school, you will need to wait with one of your grown-ups outside the school gates along Bishop Manor Road. Here, you will need to wait with a two-metre gap and there will be some lines on the ground to help you to do this. Mr Bowyer, our friendly caretaker, will be outside school to help you go in the right direction. Mr Harvey will also be there to greet you and to help you show you the way. You can come in through the double gate that leads from the car park onto the cycle path or through the top gate. There is a one-way system through our school now, so you will not be able to come in through the bottom gate on Kendon Drive, as this will be the exit. The car park gates will also be locked. We ask that only one grown-up brings you to school, as this really helps us to keep our distance and avoid any busy places. Once you have entered one of the gates, you will walk along the cycle track following the yellow line with your grown-up all the way until you get to your new drop-off spot. Mrs Taylor will be near the playground to direct you and to say hello. If you are in reception, we now have four bubbles of children who will be dropped off in different spots. If you are in yellow bubble three and green bubble four, you will be dropped off at the gates where we usually line up for playtime. You can wait with your grown-up here and there will be lines on the ground to help you to know where to stand. Mrs Pete and Miss Kolcheski will meet you here and this is where you will say goodbye to your grown-up. You will get to come through the gate all by yourselves and one at a time. Then you will head off to your classroom. If you are in reception and are in orange bubble too, you will be dropped off at the outer door of class 8, which looks like this. This is your classroom from now on. You will meet Mrs Harris and Mrs Collings and say goodbye to your grown-ups before coming in one at a time and all by yourself. If you are in reception and are in red bubble 1, you will be dropped off at the outer door of class 7, which looks like this. This will be your classroom from now on. You will meet Miss Osborne or Mrs Edwards and Mrs Atkins will always be there. You can say goodbye to your grown-ups before coming in one at a time by yourself. If you are in years one, two or three, you will wait with your grown-ups in the small playground in a line. There will be lines to help you stay two metres apart. Your teachers will come and collect you from here and take you to your classrooms. If you are in years four, five or six, you will come straight in through the side door next to the reception fence independently. Once you come in, we ask you to be very sensible and keep your two metre distance from your friends as you walk to your classroom in your lines. All children must listen carefully to teachers to find out where to put your bags and other things. Once you have put them away, the next very important job is for you to wash your hands. You will do this one at a time and in the toilet that your teacher has told you to go to. Once your grown-ups have dropped you off, they will walk out of the school through the bottom gate on Kendon Drive. Please keep your distance as you do this. Our new bowls of children will start and end their day at different times, so to avoid large groups and keep safe. When it is your time to go home, your grown-ups will come into the school in exactly the same way as they did in the morning. They will stand in the place that they dropped you off, keeping their distance as they wait using the guidelines. Your teacher will then be able to spot your grown-up and you will be able to go and meet them. If you have a brother or sister in another class, you will need to be dropped off at school at the latest time we have given you and your parents will need to come at the earliest time at the end of the day so that you can go home together. Some older children may be allowed to walk home on their own and this is fine, although you just need to let us know if this is the case. 
Once you have met your grown-up, you will leave school by walking out of the bottom gate on Kendon Drive using the one-way system. We know that you will all be able to do this really well and we look forward to seeing you soon. Have a lovely half-term!